China now is facing a new strain of the bird flu virus after it was discovered last week. So far, the new strain has claimed the lives of two people. Well, the virus is long known to have existed among poultry, and this is the first time it has been found in humans. Well, disease control scientists are busy trying to understand how it spread and what must be done to prevent it from spreading. And for the latest on that virus, we're joined live by ICS reporter Zhang Ningben in Shanghai. Well, Ningben, we understand that this is the first time this particular strain has been found in human bodies. So what can you tell us about this particular strain of virus and how did the patient get infected? Hi, Zhou Yue. Uh, the Chinese Center for Disease Control and Prevention says it isn't clear how the two people who died in Shanghai were infected, and that one of the victims had no contact with animals before his infection. And the third person, who is a woman from Anhui province, has, has been also affected by the H7N1 strain of the bird flu and is in critical condition. Doctors say she did have contact with birds before she showed any symptoms. And all the three victims had a severe pneumonia. So, Meanwhile, in Shanghai, hospitals are monitoring flu and pneumonia patients more closely after the word that weekend that two Shanghai men died recently of H7N1 bird flu, something that humans don't normally get. So let's recap the situation. 